On to chapter four, the patient. Let's see what this has to bring. Next. Leslie was being treated here years ago. He'd come here thinking it was familiar and safe. You know where we are? Just ahead is the hospice my brother runs. He'll take us in. That didn't answer my question. I honestly don't know. For all I know, I'm losing my mind and you're just a delusion. But I'd like to think I still have a shred of dignity and an obligation to protect my patient. As an officer of the law, you should too. I hope his brother's not a jerk too. <laughs> yep, he's going that way. Well, Lamb Gov is fun. Don't go so fast. Don't. Is that me talking? I'm breaking things. I want to explore now. Doctor's all trapped in his own thoughts here. Anyways, the gay has been locked out for us. That is a. Oh, he scared me. I was like, wait, what was that? He just walked on ahead and came back and shove all right into him. Doc. I wonder if this is one of the, this is probably what I mean by partnered life gauge. I'd probably be able to see his life right now because he's following me. <laughs> what if he was the new Ashley? Give give this a second thought. What if I told him like hide and put him into dumpsters and he's following at me? <laughs> what is just that visual imagery? <laughs> Anyways. Hello burning things. That's not something you see every day. That is a goat head. <laughs> I just got a mental image of like uh, him telling you to catch him up the stairs, and we just look up, and he's like, "Oh, you pervert!" <laughs> I can't get out of my head. Okay, I'm gonna neglect those thoughts right now, and <laughs> I should be careful. There might be traps. I'm losing focus. Because of the silly thoughts in my mind. I saw something move. Okay. Ha! Well, we know we're not alone anymore. Oh, ha that's a big guy. Oh jeez. He's very fast for a big guy. Don't want to use my agony crossbow shotgun, sure, why not? Oh jeez, I need to reload. Great timing, Sebastian. You're good at this. That was really satisfying. Like holy hell that was satisfying. <laughs> Find joy, patient Leslie. That's all he's gotta say all day. Apparently, I'll take this bottle. Why not? To the top. I like how this area looks. I'll give it a plus here. More exploration to get done. Shadowing, lighting. What might be in here? I'm gonna turn my light on. I think there's no enemies. Any traps? Any bear traps? That. There is coloring pages in here. Like literally crowns and pages colored here. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know he was right behind me. Map Fragment 5. I've collected all of them so far, but part 1. There's that. Is there a bomb in here? Doctor! I stopped the bomb. Just thought I'd let you know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, you have to open it like a small crack and <sighs> I'll wait to get hurt again before I use my health item. Let's go, Doc. Yeah, in this corner. Let's be sneaky snakes, Doc. I'll see what happens. Oh, it just goes through him. That's a little bit disappointing. 
All right. Well, there's not much here for me. Excuse me, Doc. You can click through your assistance. I guess I can see the reason, because if you didn't, you'd have to push them around. Oh, which everyone works. It's been the only thing which has been kind of like, not not bad, just kind of like, huh, that's a little bit weird. Maybe invisible walls with that too, but they're both very minor things, and they're just, uh, I'm trying, it's more like I'm digging for the, that than me actually thinking that's a flaw with anything. Sure is dark without my light on. I'm just going to assume I might be okay. What's this? A locked gate. We must be going. Doctor, we'll be fine. I hope. At least I think we will be. There's a new bottle to replace the one I wasted on you and Jai. Uh, someone was saying that they crouched after you like the characters in Siren. I'll be honest, this game kind of reminds me of Siren in some ways. Not completely, but there's certain elements of it that make me think of Siren. Peel away, no tearing. Who's saying that? I did hear see someone say something weird earlier as well. I mean, am I the, maybe it's only because I'm playing it. Have you guys kind of observed that too? For those who have played or watched the Siren game stuff, that there's certain elements about that are similar to Siren. It's not exactly like Siren. It's like it's a mixture of different horror things, and then it also it feels like its own thing right now to me. But there's elements that I'm like, oh, that's a little bit like Resident Evil 4. Oh, that's a little bit like Resident Evil. Oh, that's a little bit like Alan Wake. Oh, that's a little bit like Siren, and you know that sort of thing, which I'm a okay with. Through. I could probably burn that, but I'm gonna neglect this for now. I guess I know the save area is over there. Jeez, so much to explore. I love this game's level design. I just wanna say this right now. I'm loving how there's so many just little areas. I don't even know if I need to go over there, but I want to. But you notice how there's like a lot of different vistas and areas to explore if you really want to, which I do want to. Hush, hush, don't you fret. Who is talking right now? I'm, I'm close enough to get the subtitles. The good doctor is here. Again, I'm, I'm close enough that I'm, get, I'm getting things, but I don't know who's talking. I don't actually hear the voices. I guess over here. Or somewhere over here. I am having very much fun playing on this. It so far has not let me down to my expectations for it. Okay, I'll follow that in a second. I'm kind of curious what's over here first. I like the fog look there. Hush, hush, don't you fret. I need to find We this. must find my patient, Leslie. We're doing our best, Doc. Alright, I fucking absolutely in a ditch. Let's open this up. I never trust doctor characters in horror games. I've come to that conclusion after so many doctor characters have betrayed me over time. What could have happened here? There's a number of different possibilities, but expose everything. Certainly not alone. Doc, please keep yourself safe. The enemy sounds super close. That's you, Doc. Stay away from me to tell Doc to stay here. Oh, he's probably outside. Got him. <laughs> he dropped an axe. Convenient. There's a few hiding spots in here if I absolutely need it. These are shotgun shells. Good to have. Peel away. No tearing. Excuse me again, Doc. So much to see. So much to see. So much to do. I'm not going to fucking sing a Smash Mouth song right now. Mostly broke this door open. Let's go. <laughs> I wonder what's on the other side. We must be going. Shut up! Did you not hear that someone's whispering?
Agni crossbow in case I would missed the first one. That's nice of the developers. Because it was more than possible to miss the shotgun and the Agni crossbow, so... I guess they gave a second chance to pick it up if you missed it in the last chapter. Interesting. The is here. Somebody's down here. Doesn't sound like a haunted. Doesn't exactly sound like a sane man either, but... What's in here? Another syringe. Take one of those. This is the front door, right? Let me find out. Yep, this is the front door. Let's check this out then. More box to break here. They definitely sound like they're in here. Just in case I end up needing more, I'll keep that in mind. This person's very insensitive to his surroundings. I if I see somebody there. Be a little bit cautious, there could be traps around here. Or green gel. That's good too. We must be going. You're very impatient, you know that? Because you are. Well, that wasn't my intended way to get out. I go up here. Ah, it's my best. I'll come back to him in a second. It's probably a story moment. Don't forget about me. <laughs> That's some, the doctor's not jumping out the window. He's just like, Hey, Doc. Didn't forget about you. Just was neglecting to take care of you. That's all. See that bomb? Actually, is that a note? I think it's just a note. I was worried for nothing. Journal Sebastian Castellanos, February 2005. Myra was almost killed this afternoon, shot by a suspect we were pursuing. Thank God I was there. She's going to be okay. But seeing her bleeding like that, thinking I was going to lose her without telling her how I really feel, was unbearable. I think she feels the same way. There's something undeniable between us. It's against the code of conduct, but I have to let her know how I feel about her. I hope I'm not setting myself up for embarrassment. So, Sebastian became a detective after for some reason he changed his name to Sebastian Castellanos. I don't know why he changed his name, I still don't fully understand. It's definitely a safer area, so let's see. However, he met a woman named Myra who he was uh, infatuated with there. Break! In outside view. Excuse me, Doc, I need to go into my delusions. Oh, Sebastian, why do you keep on staring in that mirror? Sebastian, what are you doing? Why aren't you responding to me? <sighs> the nurse was right behind us. Why did it suddenly change? Why is everything black and white and creepy music? Crimson City map is continuing to form. Alright, this is a bit different. There she goes. I guess she wants us to follow. Again, I guess she wants us to follow. This isn't exactly what I was expecting, but I guess I can roll with it. Is she over here, over there? Well, she's not over there, and this door's never been closed before. So I'll assume she's over here. Yeah, there she is. She's right at the end of this hall. No, no, not that way. No. No, no, not that way. No. No, no, not that way, no. Hmm. No, no, not that way, no. You just don't want me to do anything, do you? Is that map fragment? Map fragment six. No, not that way, no. 
No. No. Not that way. No. Okay, sir. No. No. Not that way. Oh, so many new admissions. And not a single discharge. Huh. Let go of me! Let go of me! Let go of me! Let go of me! Oh dear. Well, this is fine. now as. Fine. 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 And Leslie. Fine. Leslie? You don't look well at all. Do take care of yourself. Hi. Valerio. Dr. Valerio Jimenez, owner of the Elk River Hospice, last seen driving into the city. Right, which means that's probably a new, new a new newspaper article. Let's go check that out. Missing patient found. Missing patient found. Caretaker worried sick. Psychiatric patient missing since last Tuesday. Found hiding in photography studio. Physician Valerie Jimmy says good God's will. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. It's a few things I want to do here before I save. The first thing I'll do is upgrade. Actually, no, wait, no, no, I could get green gel. Because I should probably then first use the key. Also, I can see if there's still hanging bullets ever since the chapter changed. This will be official confirmation, finally, if I uh, keep stuff or not. I missed piece one, but I did get all the rest of the pieces so far. I'm not sure what the map is forming, but it's definitely forming some. It's forming in Crimson City, I understand that, but... Okay, good. If you just, you can pick this stuff up at any time. It literally just stays there. That is incredibly useful to know. Which means I can just leave something if I don't, if I can't pick it up right now. That's, that makes me so relieved. And here we find, ooh, green gel. <laughs> Speak of the devil. I was just saying I bet we'd find some, like, something like that. And indeed we did. Through and through. I have to say, there's some nice attention to detail in certain elements of this game, which I'm very appreciative of. Anyways, upgrade. They were definitely thinking about things from a very player-friendly level, I think. Sure, I'll upgrade. Da -da 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 -da. All right, I could upgrade my minimum sprint time again. Sure, why not? It's a nice thing to have up. Gotta go fast and all that <laughs> stupid ass shit I could be saying. Uh, I could have actually upgraded one of my guns and damage things if I had thought about it, but I didn't, so it's too late for that. There's also a new section for agony bolts, explosive bolts, flash bolts, and harpoon bolts. I do like explosive bolts. Can I just upgrade these? Yes, I can. All right. <laughs> Increases the damage by a little bit. Flash bolts and harpoon bolts. All right. Anything else I can upgrade? How about my abilities? Melee damage, I can upgrade that by a little bit. I bet it has its uses there. Yes. <laughs> there we go. Set pretty okay with the world right now. I could save my game, but there's actually something which I'm curious about. Curiosity prevails me to see if this door is open now. It is not. It was just a weird dream? Reality? Premonition? I don't fucking know. Save my game. Right there. Except. Now then, take me back to the crazy world mirror. You're the closest mirror to the checkout, so you're the one I will most commonly use. Where must we going? Jeff. <laughs> the first thing I say. Were you just staring at me while I was looking at this mirror this whole time? Well, you have to think what he was thinking. I was like, what the fuck is Sebastian doing? Here. 
let's see. Things to view. Jimmez, come this way, Doc. Oh, there's my axe. It was just left outside on the table. That's nice. We found him! Before we check that out, I guess, since... I think he sees me. I guess I am in the shadows. Stop looking right at me. If I move, I know he'll see me, because that's happened to me before. As long as I stay perfectly still, he may not actually see me, but he's looking right my way. Maybe he does see me, he's just waiting for me to make the first move. Let me know when you're taking care of Alright. Got some green gem. Yeah, just a giant burning pile of bodies. I wonder if we could save this person who is now impaled and burning. Maybe. Time to kick pig. Good pig. Took him like a pig. There are some things. Oh, geez. You think you could burn this? Like, move the fire into the other place? That'd be pretty amusing if we could. Scarecrow. I was thinking there might be a secret over here. What? I don't see anything. Jim is just having fun with me back here, though. There we go. Not gonna burn any of these things right now. Some of these collectibles, I repeat, are again kind of tricky. You probably could move a burning haystack into this. I kind of like how it's like a little farming area. Uh, so, wait, is that? Hi! Didn't see you there, missus. That's unfortunate for you. Nothing back there in that hidden wheelbarrow. Little shack thing. I like the exploration element in this game again. Neglecting my duties of trying to save the people. Let's go check up. I wonder actually that doctor we heard earlier, the voice. I wonder if that's Dr. Uh, Jimez. This guy is his brother, I think? Something like that? I haven't quite put it together, to be honest, but something like that. That probably is him, because he was said, said that his brother owned the hospice, and that was a doctor before, and the color just literally changed. Come in, doctor. And you guys do kind of sound alike. Okay, that's probably his brother, then. He's waiting for the doctor to actually appear. There you are, Doc. There's no time for fooling around. There's always time for fooling around. Shut up, Doc. Hush, hush. Don't need to fret. Hush, hush. Don't you fret. Doc, no, don't. Valerio, it's me. The good doctor is here. This is my brother, Valerio. Leslie's original doctor. Peel away. Yes, expose everything. Hey, what are you doing? Doc. Don't anyone tell you otherwise. Do I even have handgun bullets? I do, but I have to reload them. Alright, let's see. I think I have some bullets. Where oh, geez, are you after the dock? Good. Focus on me. I'd rather you not ruin my... Assistant, I guess it is in this case. Jeez, goddamn, you're so big. You think I'd be able to hit you even though I've got my rack up? Out of ammo. There's the doc. Where's he even trying to go? How'd that miss? 
Bad time to reload me. Bad. Great time to reload, I mean. He's dead, Jim. It's funny because his name is Jim Ez. Who do what to the ha? Huh? Couldn't be Ruvik. Ruvik? Okay, I know who Ruvik is. What do you know, Doc? Anyways, though. Skull, chin, body. Breaking things. <laughs> Copying machine stuff over here. Let's not examine here. Ooh, there's keys in the diagram next to the spinal cord. Alright, let's see how this is going. I guess the doc left us a present. Not you, doc, the other doc, I mean. Uh, where, where was it? Give me a second. Look at that diagram again. So that side of the spinal cord, sort of towards the middle there, exactly, it's pretty near the belly, it'd be a little bit above the belly button, all that fun stuff. Alright. If I am to believe myself correctly, I bet it's probably where this knife wound is over here. My head is in the way. It's like, okay, it's a key for the key collecting thing. That's not what I would have predicted. He's dead, Jim. Well, it is what it is there. Hey, Doc, you don't want to come in here anymore? I guess it makes sense. Your brother did just die. Sympathies on that, at least. Bullets? No, that's, that's, that's pretty okay. I think we've explored the rest of here. We must be going. Leslie? <laughs> That came from outside. Yes. Leslie doesn't sound to be in a very good way right now. Probably figure it out in a little bit though. Hop! Got a few more things I want to explore before I fall. Asleep. What? Well, that was something. It's actually surprised me there, and she got me some blue. Why was she glowing? Ah oh, well. Let's see. I gotta pick up that. I cannot destroy this. Can I open this? No. Okay. In this next area, we have. Matches, don't need any more matches at the very moment. I'm gonna walk around slowly in case there's a trap in here though. That was an harpoon. It's oh I thought it was a noose in the angle I saw that first. Bottle's better than no bottle. I always waste it pretty simply. Like those windows are gonna open. Alright, back on out. Leslie went inside there, so I'm going to explore over here first just to make a 100% sure there's nothing here that I need to collect or something I'd miss or anything like that. It's all part of the fun after all. What's that to pick up? 
Oh, I didn't see the green gel there. I will take it. Thank you very much. I'm happy I have left interactions on. There'd be so many items I'd be missing without that on. Though I do enjoy the headlessness. Another passageway here, but it's blocked we off. We must by... find my patient, Leslie. We know where he is. Shut up. What's up with these scarecrows? They got like Native American style mask on their face. I wonder if that means anything. Anyways, though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> What? Actually, there's nothing over here. Anything that I can collect, like a map fragment, or statue to destroy, or windows to break through. I'd prefer to enter through the front door, though, personally speaking. All things look pretty okay. Probably just needed a key? No, didn't need any keys. I could just come in here the whole time. Oh, right, the key which I got wasn't really a key. Right. All that broken stuff. Someone hasn't kept this place well trained at all. And it's got a cabinet. Yes! That door looks slightly busted off its hinges. Call me skeptic that's gonna lead to anything good. The bed's been slammed into it, apparently. No room for matches. Could hide in the closet. You'll never know where I am, Doc. Oh my God, the doctor doesn't know where. Okay, hi, Doc. I was hiding in the closet the whole time. Very sneaky, I know. We got some pictures here. We got farmer. We got whatever these are. We got. Whatever, the, I guess it's farming people. He's gone down there. You don't say. Maybe that's a horse, might be a cow. Just looking at that these. That was probably worth checking out. You don't say, Doc. Sorry, I was just having technical problems with my body. Some lonely old lady just sitting there. Let's roll. Sneak down to the basement for reasons. Alright, I'm curious what this is leading off to. Got a bottle in case anything goes terribly wrong. Hey, Doc, the lighting changed. I just thought I'd let you know. It's the candle light that's changing things. We'll say it's a certain type of moody. Another weapon case. It has a shotgun inside of it. Oh, it's just got shells. Harpoon thing I can't take. Matches I have to avoid. Let's go on through. This door does look interesting. I can't say that. I like the artistic direction, the lighting with the red on the. Okay, that's an awkward room. Let's go inside. Cool. Be sneaky, Doc. Never trust anything but me. Only trust me. I click that. Neglecting. Ooh. There's some books. I'd rather not move. Leslie. Oh, thank heavens. Dr. Hermenis is here. Settle down. Wait, Doc. I think something's coming. Something here. Settle down. I hear something coming. Oh, jeez. There is something there. Something scary. I already have trouble aiming. Well, that's new. No. No. There's nothing to be afraid of. Burn it, burn it. Scared. 
No, stay right here. Burn it, burn it once down. This place is a death trap. Is there anywhere safe at all? I think that's unlikely. Hmm. Can't get out. Can't get out. We must be going this way. Well, he might have seen something Can't here. Can't get away. Can't get away. See green gel. Would have missed that. Listen, to your instructions there, Doc. Oh, here on the shelf. More green gel. See, Doc. That's why I don't listen to you. Because you're a moron. I need more green gel. Nom, 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 to my green gel collection. Interesting, though. Very interesting. The last enemy encounter. Let's go on through. 